Hi, in this video we will discuss about range operators. Range operators are used to define a range from a starting point to a ending point. Ranges are divided into three types. First is a closed range. In a closed range, the values start from a starting point and go up to an ending point in which the last value is also included. It is given by three dot operators between the starting value and the ending value like a dot 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 b. The second type is a half open range. In half open range, the operator is double dot operator followed by a smaller than symbol in which we write like the starting point double dot smaller than value and the ending point. This gives value from the starting point up to the ending point but it does not include the last value. The last one is one sided range. They are further divided into two types. First one is from the starting value up to the number of elements and the second one is from the starting value up to the given value a. For example in this one 1 followed by 3 dots will give from 1 to the last element available and this one will give from the beginning up to the second element available. Now we will see a practical implementation of range operators on our playground. The syntax of for loop is first we will write the for keyword followed by any variable name followed by the in keyword and then the range. This is the closed range in which the first value and the last value of the range are also given and they are also included. Inside this for loop we will write first to identify which loop is running we have written closed range after that we are printing the value of x each time x will be given the value in the range after every repetition of this loop for example the first value of x will be 1 then 2 then 3 then 4 and the last value will be 5 when this loop will execute then we'll get the following output closed range 1 closed range 2 closed range 3 till closed range 5 this is the output of this for loop similarly this is the half open range. This means that the range will be from 1 to 4 only. But 4 will not be included in this. So the output for this will be half open range. First time it will be x will be 1. Second time the x will be 2. And third time the x will be 3. 4 will not be included in this. This is how we can use range in our Swift language. Thank you.